the current Australian 100 metre champion Shane Naylor running in lane number three tonight he won in Christchurch on Saturday evening the number one Australian in 1992 and it's a very good field here this evening possibly even stronger than the one we saw in Christchurch on Saturday night with Jason John running in lane number four and Kevin Braunschool both have come down from the 200 metres to join Naylor Williams and the very fast New Zealander Todd Blythe who'll run in lane number two is Jason John from Great Britain. He has a personal best of 10.31, ranked third in the UK in 1992. And Jeff Williams, second in Christchurch with a time of 10.54 and that very strong headwind. But tonight, the sprinters have the advantage of a substantial tailwind. It'll be very interesting to see just how fast they can run in these conditions, John Davies. It'll be a great race. This is the greatest field we've ever assembled in 100 metres in Wellington, that's for sure. It matches almost a Commonwealth Games final. Not to forget Lot Kodjo, the ex Ghanaian, now the New Zealander, running there in lane number eight. And alongside of him, Hugh Percy and Todd Blythe, who broke the under 18 record in Christchurch. He's running in lane two. Set. And away first time and a good, clean, even start coming through again as Naylor down there in lane number three. Alongside of him, Jason John. It's a big line up here, but tonight it's Jason John. Jason John won the 200 metres in Christchurch, halves the distance, but stays a winner. Actually, you'd have to go with about 10, 20 something for that, but it's an absolutely smart time. Todd Blythe in lane, lane two got left behind tonight, and Shane Naylor, we've had a good start, but look at Jason John in lane four. This man from Birmingham, England, is a real flyer over any distance. He narrowly wins this great uh, 100 metres lineup, and the time is excellent indeed. But this is Jason John, number 103. He was blasted everybody around him. Shane Naylor, the nugget man from Australia, couldn't do it tonight. Well, Jason, we thought it was a bit faster than 10.38. Are you pretty happy with that, though? I've still got to be happy with that. Um, I'm not too sure what the wind was. I knew he sort of he ended up as a headwind. The last 20, 30 metres was actually a headwind. But um, as I said to the press earlier today, I think the wind was a lot more important than the actual time. He's actually a sort of top quality sort of field out there today. And he's always going to be hard. And um, just nice to sort of get a win. I'll settle with that. <laughs> That's how it finished officially in the Lotto Men's 100 metres. Jason John of Great Britain winning from the two Americans. And Shane Naylor, first in Christchurch, tonight could only finish fourth.